Hello everybody, my name is Troublemaker and today we're going to uh, show a more advanced tip for the game. Uh, so to start off, I'm going to lay down just whatever block that you happen to have. I just wanted to get a little bit higher so we can see. And uh, we're going to put our seat on it. So in terms of how the game works, if this block here is destroyed, the seat is gone as well. So we're going to create an ejection seat. That way when the last minute comes, you're not so screwed. Uh, now I don't have any um, helium cubes here, so we're going to grab one real quick. A nice cheapy armored one. And we're going to lay down a helium cube underneath. Now what this is going to do, of course, is float your seat into the air. Uh, now another thing is that if you have no components left, you also die. You're basically dead if you have no wheels, no, um, you know, anything. Uh, so we're going to create a more advanced ejection seat. We're looking for uh, thrusters, and I believe I've actually grabbed those off of something else right now. Let's see, which one has the thrusters? This guy has the thrusters. So I'm just going to quickly grab a thruster off this guy. I'm, we're not looking at the best or the brightest. This isn't going to take too far from your uh, tech score. And... Put on our thruster. There we go. Now what this is going to do is when we lose everything else, we're going to fly up in the air and our jet pack here is going to throw us away from the enemy as fast as humanly possible. So what's going to end up happening is if you lose all your components and you want to get that day one win, right? Because you're in a tier that's way too high for you. You will still survive and you'll still get double the points. Uh, this is definitely a highly recommended way of building for everyone. And from here you just build up to encase your seat and build wide to give yourself some extra stuff. And this is not a flight build. You would actually build wheels down here, sir. Yes. Uh, and you know, this total uh, containment here has only cost me 23 of my P-flops. I have 886 of them. So if you're looking at a higher tier fight, and I'm talking like tier 5 and up, this is definitely the way that you should probably align your tank. An ejection seat will always pay off. My name is Trailmaker. Thank you guys for watching.